the 19, it says, um, And I saw the beast and the kings of the earth and their armies, which would be their angels, their armies are their angels, get it together to make war against him that sat on a horse and against his armies. So that's talking about to make war against Yahweh Shah and the angels. And they're going to be doing that right here. You'll be able to look up and see it. You might get zapped by a laser too. And it says, uh, verse 20. Let me see. No, I was at 19. I had, hell, I was, like, I was supposed to be at 9. But the Most High wanted me to read that. That's good. All right, uh, Revelation 19 and 9. And he said unto me, Right, blessed are they which are called unto the marriage. The, mar the marriage supper of the Lamb. And he said unto me, These are the true sayings of Yahweh. Verse 10, And I fell at his feet to worship him. So this is John in the book of Revelations. He fell at his feet to worship this angel. Right? And he said unto me, See, thou do it not. The angel said, Hold on, get up, bro. Don't, don't worship me. Don't fall down and worship me. So this is what the angel is telling John. So why did the angel tell John not to worship him? I'm going to go ahead and tell you that. It's because John is an angel too. Angel just means messenger. John was a messenger. John is one of the fallen angels. Right, I'm going to go ahead and tell you that. And I'm going to continue reading. He says, see, see thou do it not. I am thy fellow servant. So the angel said, listen, I'm just like you. I'm your fellow servant. We equal. I'm no greater than you. You're no greater than me. We are both angels. We are both messengers of the Most High. I'm your fellow servant. I serve you. You serve me. We we the same. He says, and of thy brethren, he said, we brothers. He says, and of thy brethren that have the testimony of Yahweh Shah. To have the testimony of Yahweh Shah means you had to once be on earth and he died for your sins. That's the only way you can have the testimony of Yahweh Shah, which is the prophecy of Yahweh, which is the prophecies. So for this angel to say that I also have the testimony of Yahweh Shah, that means he was once here, now he's he's dead, so-called dead, or went to sleep, and he's back in the heavens with the fathers. He said, worship Yahweh, for the testimony of Yahweh Shah is the spirit of prophecy. He said, I'm your brother, don't worship me. He said, I'm your fellow servant. You are an angel and I'm an angel. And he had the testimony of Yahweh Shah, for the testimony of Yahweh Shah is prophecy, the spirit of prophecy. So that lets you know that this was a prophet talking to a prophet. He's just in the spiritual realm doing the work now and waiting until he be reborn onto the earth if he come back in the third or fourth generation to be born onto the earth. And you can see this in, uh, 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 let me see, what's that? Ecclesiastes. Ecclesiastes, I think 12 and, 12 and 7 or something. Let me see. Um, 12 and 7, yeah. Then shall the dust, this is what happened when you so-called pass away or die. Then shall the dust return to the earth as it was. And the spirit was in you, who you really are, shall return unto God who gave it. Or shall return unto Yahweh who gave it. So if I drop dead right now, so-called dead right now, no sleep, my spirit would shoot straight from here, straight back to the Father. Ain't no lingering around all this stupid shit they telling you in the churches. Ain't none of that. When you pass, your spirit goes back to the Father. So if you was a prophet out here on the streets, when you get back up there to the, uh, uh, to the Father, if the Most High needs something done, he's going to send you as an angel to do it, and you're going to go back. And you're going to wait on your turn to be born back into the heavens, the third and fourth generations. All right, so I'm going to end with that. I pray that you was edified, you know, just to let you know that we are those fallen angels. You so-called Negroes, Hispanics, and Native Americans. And Satan is the so-called white man that's going to be cast out of power. And the angels, and his angels, is his people and the other nations of the world that's going to fight against Yahweh, Michael, and the angels. So with that being said, I hope you was glorified. I mean, I hope you was edified. And I'm going to say Barakatai. That's blessing the Most High. Barakatai Yahweh. Barakatai Yahweh Shai. Barakatha Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shah, Shalom to Israel, Yasha Ella, Shalom Israel. You know, brother Zahar is out.